All right, this right here is the easiest way to download Minecraft Java Edition down here on your Chromebook, which what you're going to need to do first is on settings, you want to go to Linux. You want to make sure you have Linux turned on. Okay, if your computer turns it off, I mean, your school turns it off like mine did, just ask them to turn it on because this is my only computer. Um, and you want to have it, the disk at least bigger than maybe seven. Um, I'll mute this real quickly so it doesn't get in the way. Um, so you want to go to this site and Minecraft download. Um, and I'll put it in the description. And you want to download it for Debian and Debian based industries. This is pretty much the whole Linux thing. It's a really simple. And you just want to go to files recent and you'll get since mine I, i'm not downloading it again because i don't have enough storage so we'll see minecraft and you want to move that file into linux that should take a couple of seconds not that long and then you want to double click it and install with linux and then boom and then after that's only maybe a minute or less couple of seconds it's been your computer you get this but you're gonna have to get sign up so you're gonna have to buy the game unless you want to play the demo which you can do now and then you're just gonna play it but be also when you play you want to turn on mouse lock for linux apps because else like you can't turn um and single player doesn't really work so multiplayer is the, probably the best to use i like guess server and also so i'll send i put the mouse lock thing so you can turn it on in my description you're gonna have to restart your computer and um optifine you can download and that's how, if you want to play servers it's, it's just being a bit stupid uh, so it's not that laggy it's going to be a bit laggy because i'm recording obviously but i think you can get up to 60 frames probably a little more um in the servers it's laggy but i think it's just because it's like quite a lot of people and one thing that does happen is a glitch and it's um what is it? Uh, sorry, if not talking, but pretty much when you go over here, like you don't have it in here, and you just go here, it's like, or oh, you go to here and then you come back. Usually, you can't turn it fully, but all you want to do is press go. Like when you go back to game, just click it on there, and then you have it. Um, it's actually not that bad since I'm recording, but it is better when I'm not recording. Keep in mind, and you can only download on 1.16.4, what I've discovered so far. So, um, because I try to do it on one, you can download it, but like you can't run servers. That's the problem. So, yeah. But you can, you, you it's not at this side, it's actually pretty good, and you can download Optifine. And if this video actually gets some views, I'll show you how to download Steam and Optifine. Yeah, that's pretty simple and it's not that hard. So yeah, there you go.